Hey guys, I just wanted to shoot this uh, sh a short video before I take off here tonight because uh, I went down to Harbor Freight to grab uh, another two McCullough 1275 steamers so we don't have to keep passing the same one around the shop here. And um, they have replaced them now in my area with these uh, central machinery um, steam kits. Uh, it's a 1500 watt steamer. Um, 45 minute capacity of steam. Um, the cord and the hose are about eight foot, eight inches long. Um, just like the other one, it reaches 212 degrees, which is, is fine. I don't want anything with more pressure or anything that gets hotter with the delicate fabrics we deal with um, here, so we don't have to worry about that. I don't need, um, I don't need the uh, extremely powerful vapor machines. And before I forget, I can already tell you this, the plastic is much cheaper. I already broke one of the attachments for the squeegee. And also the brush attachments, the uh, bristles are much softer. They're gonna wear down a heck of a lot faster than the McCullough 1275s. Um, so I just got one of the um, central machinery and I'll just order another McCullough later. This has a 41 ounce reservoir and uh, I'm gonna show it to you here. So on the front of it, it has LED lighting for the on light and for the steamer light. The power button is on the back, fill cap is on the top. The handle and trigger are quite different than the McCullough 1275 as you squeeze it instead of using your thumb for a thumb switch. Two extension tubes. Your squeegee attachment, floor brush attachment with mop, instruction manual. Then when it comes to the brushes, you have your triangle brush, large bristle brush with two rows, soft brushes, you get three of those. These bristles are real soft. I can tell you they're going to wear down quick. Um, here you have the brass brush. There you have the jet nozzle attachment. You have your scrubber and then finally your fill funnel and measuring cup. Forty-one ounces will fill her up, boys and girls. Distilled water only. Power switch is on the back here. Then you have your LEDs for power on, and when that goes off, it's ready to steam. Indicator light is off, ready to go. going to demonstrate a little bit. We're going to start off with the jet nozzle. Great for getting in the you know corners, hard to reach places, places where you want to blow out dust, um, maybe dirt and grit that got stuck in between panels.
Next is the scrubber attachment, kind of like a scotch Bright pad. Here's the small brush attachment. Large brush attachment. Triangle brush. And here are your two extension wands. If you can wait and order the 1275 or the next model up, I would recommend you do so. If you're in a pinch and you have to have one right away, um, you know, at $119, that's up to you, but I would wait. And the last attachment is the floor brush and floor mop. And that's going to be it guys. The central machinery steam cleaner kit is not something I can recommend, but if you are in a pinch, go for it.